over here. Ah. Um, um, I was in the boat and I saw the. Oh. You gotta pay attention. Okay. Um. So we are going to take you on a creek walk. Okay. Yeah. We'll just start going this way. Above the uh, dirt. These are called pit traps, and what they do is they collect bugs. So if you see any of these, you can still terrorize them or go look at one and see if there's any bugs inside. Yeah, just point one out if you see one, and then we'll go check one out. And if we see, see some too, we'll tell you. Yeah. See what? A little pit trap. They look like little plastic plates. See, here's one right over yeah. here. Right here. So if you guys just want to gather around over here, this is one of our pit traps. And the this little shelf thing that we have over it is to keep the water out in case it rains or anything. So what it is, is a little cup. And as you guys can see, there's nothing in there. There's a little bit of dirt. But what happens is we put that there so we can catch any type of bug that's kind of like crawling by and will simply just fall into the little bucket and yeah. then we'll catch them. They fall in right here when this is function? on. Yeah, and then that way they can't get out. Yeah, they can't get out, but they're still safe in there. Yeah. So then we put the cap back on so the water doesn't get back in and then go to the next one. Okay. Alright, so that's fine. Follow Jared. Hi, Mama. No, actually. I'm going to talk about the pit traps. Talk loud, Jared. Bugs? No bugs. No bugs. No luck. Okay. All right. So let's go this way. <coughs> I'm scared. I'm Watch out for the branches because it's simple. It's going to pull it up and it's going to put some things in your dish. Grab it. So let's go this way. And there's a big hole right there, so go around over there. Oh, God. Oh, my. It's all brain over there. That's where the path is. Watch your step. Let's wait up a second. Make sure we got everybody. Tell me if you guys see anything on the ground. Ants. You see ants. You guys see ants? Lots of ants? Yes. Come on, all the way up in here. Okay. Now look in here and what do you see? Ants. Ants. Be careful. Oh. Ah. <laughs> ah. 
Okay, so as you can see, there's a lot of ants here. And inside, this is kind of like their home. And there's thousands and thousands of ants. And you can even kind of see them like yeah, on the ground all and all back over, over there. Um, last week, or yeah, last yeah, week, last week. Um, our class came out here and we had three live crickets. And that's kind of what the ants feed on. And so we, one by one, kind of flung a cricket on there. And it's only like a matter of seconds before the ants kind of like attack it and eat it pretty much. They kind of like rip it apart and share it amongst all the other ants. So, so what, what color for the back sheet? What color are their body segments on your back page? What color are the body segments? You have that ant on the back. Uh, what color are they on the back right here? You can draw. On the back page. I'll write down what color they are. Red! Yes, red. Red and so, black. Red where? Um, take a look at it. Take a close up at an ant. What you got? Where's the red? Look at the ground. There may be some on the ground. Face says the red. Their face is red. Good. Mm -hmm. They've got a red head. And a black body. And a black body. Good. All right. Okay. All right. Moving on. Okay. 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 Go, Jared. This water and I was like, walk around the hole, and she stepped on it. Okay. Well, he's gone anyways. It went away, so we couldn't grab it.
Stay right here. Really sharp teeth, and they go around and they kind of bite away at pieces of wood. So here and here it has pieces of wood. And the beaver goes up, and this piece, if you feel it, it's kind of got like some rough edges to it. The beaver actually bit that off and yeah. refused. We have a skull. Yeah. Here, so. so here's the skull. Yeah. See how these beavers have really big teeth? They actually have to gnaw away these teeth because they grow just like your hair and toenails. They keep growing on forever, so they have to cut it. And so what they do is they trim on the tree just like this, and they cut it down, and they eat it, and then they take the tree that they collect and they move it to their dam so they can use it for their lodge. Yeah, and so underneath that dam is actually a little lodge that they in it. No, this is just this is just a dead one yeah. that we have. They're still alive. This one's just alive. Yep. Do you want to feel it? Go ahead. Beavers? Yeah, beavers. Oh, I see beavers. Those teeth look like carrots. Do they? <laughs> kind of. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Okay, we have to go. <laughs> this is not enough time. We've barely talked about anything. Okay, we're going to follow Jared right back over to where those people are over there. Uh, we need to keep this? Yes. All day? Yes. Yes. Yeah. I'm fat and pregnant. No, it's okay. <laughs> They are just about to start the change with stream flow right now. So I'm supposed to tell them each time we switch. Yeah, just be like stream flow. We're about to switch. We're on our way to switch with you. And then as soon as you pick up stream flow, you say whatever, water testing one, we're about to come switch with you, or benthic macros, you know, whatever. Because water testing, oh no, benthic macros is next, then water testing one, then water testing three. Okay. Just let them know. Yeah. 
Okay.